let's face it. This is the one you were waiting for. From what I saw, if it wasn't, it should be. But so another trailer that was shown at Comic-Con was the trailer to Deadpool. And like every other trailer that was shown at Comic-Con ever, it was leaked online, bootleg version of it. Unlike the other ones, they didn't release it, they didn't roll with it, and they were like, eh, whatever, it's been bootleg here. Here's the high def version. No, Fox is holding out, man. They're like, not yet. I guess we get one in three weeks. I don't know if it's gonna be the same as this or different. I hope different because I'm talking about this one now and I just don't want to repeat myself in three weeks. Point is, this Deadpool trailer looks really, really good. Funny thing is, Deadpool Deadpool is like a Comic-Con thing at this point because last year after Comic-Con that test footage leaked online leaked online which is pretty much the studio going all right we'll leak it and we'll see if the fans love it we all loved it so now it's a movie and the scene that was the Deadpool test footage is actually in this trailer so it's in the movie the story is Wade Wilson has cancer so this ominous dude comes to him and he's like we can make you better we can make you a superhero so he has his procedure done and he becomes Deadpool but you see all the meta humor in this trailer that you wanted in a Deadpool movie and you're like oh my god they're doing it perfectly like when the guy's like we're gonna make you a superhero here he's like just make sure the super suit isn't green or animated that's really funny shit i love a gratuitous amount of meta humor and this looks to have it and the action looks kick-ass too deadpool's got some straight up moves like the scene where he whips around he shoots his gun the bullet goes through three dudes simultaneously and after he kicks all these dudes asses he's like boom like suck it and shit he just gets nailed by Colossus from the X-Men. Totally caught me off guard. I had no idea they were gonna start crossing roads and shit. After he gets plowed by Colossus, he stands up, he's like, you big chrome cock block. There's this girl with him and he's like, so what's your name? And she's like, Negasonic Teenage Warhead. He's like, Negasa, what the shit? That is the coolest name ever. And he cues the music to the camera and then music comes on and a bunch more kick ass rig. Greatest Stan Lee cameo ever though. If you haven't seen the trailer, I don't want to ruin it for I feel like that's something you would take out of the trailer because you want to save it for the movie. But greatest Stan Lee cameo ever. Really it is. I love the catchphrase in the trailer too. With great power comes great irresponsibility. It's just too good to not have. Ultimately, this trailer proves that the abomination that was Deadpool in the abomination that was the X-Men Origins Wolverine movie was terrible, but it wasn't Ryan Reynolds fault. Everyone knew at the time that he was a good pick for Deadpool, if they did Deadpool at all in there. I'm really glad Ryan Reynolds is getting a mulligan for this role, and I'm glad that he is showing that he is perfect for the role. Love that dialogue at the end, though, where I believe it's gotta be his friend, right? If you're talking shit to someone like that, you feel like it's the dude's friend. Because Deadpool's face is all messed up. He sees him, he's like, motherfucker, you are hard to look at. You look like Freddy Krueger fucked a topographical map of Utah. It was that funny. I lost my shit to that one. I was like, hey, good job, trailer. Oh, just it, this just dawned on me just now. They're gonna come out with a trailer. It's totally gonna be a green band trailer. This trailer was a red band trailer, man. They had the shits, the fucks, the dammits, the blood. It was great. Whatever trailer you see online or in the movie theater, it's gonna be a green band trailer. Here's hoping for a red band trailer. Guys, in the end, Deadpool is looking like it's the perfect Deadpool movie that you want. I want more of that meta humor. I want him to fight someone. He just takes the boom mic from off stage and starts beating someone with it. I have high hopes for this one, man. If you weren't a Deadpool fan before, you'll watch this trailer and you're like, yeah. That's a cool character. I can see what all the fuss is about. So the Comic-Con Deadpool trailer from Hull H or Bootleg or wherever you watched it. Have you seen it? What did you think about it? Whatever you thought, comment below. Let me know. And as always, if you like what you've seen here and you want to see more, click right here to see more.